Hello, welcome to my Airstream. My name is Charles Bordner. Uh, I have a Pottery Barn 2022 limited edition. So when you're checking in, uh, first off, you're gonna get the keys at the uh, clubhouse down there. First off, I do wanna talk about the door. Um, let's turn this thing around. So here you're looking at the door. Um, as far as, it, if you're pulling on it here, you're not, you're going to get a little frustrated because it's a little harder but if you put your thumb in here and just you'll get a, a nice click. now when you shut it you you do need to shut it very firmly and don't don't worry about that but opening it the, that little thumb is going to be the trick but anyway you can see you got a sofa here if you do need to get a laptop out got a little bit of a workspace here that you can work at uh, at the same time you can watch TV and that just folds up here and just folds down okay you got to throw there got your coffee um, fix this sign you got your coffee paper towels some uh, if you're going to cook or anything, you got some cleaning stuff. Do have uh, cast iron here, um, and there's cast iron outside as well. Uh, you've got your table, got your little little dinette area. Um, you got your TV that's been upgraded. That's a QLED Samsung 32 inch. So please enjoy that. Uh, different things in the cabinets. Uh, you've got bowls plates uh, feel free to use any condiment or groceries that you see in here uh, uh, as far as monitoring everything uh, this wastewater is going to be zero when you check in uh, uh, gray water and wastewater should be at zero uh, you don't necessarily have to worry about your gray water and you're if you're asking well charles what's gray water well that's going to be your you know your shower your um, your sinks bathroom sink in this sink too um, and then your wastewater okay okay your wastewater okay that's going to be of course the toilet uh, those numbers will be at zero uh, unless you're staying for a long period of time you will not have to worry about that uh, you got your fridge, okay, uh, shower, uh, the shower here on the bottom right, if you click right here, you got the light that comes on in the shower, and that fan came on too, but anyway, you got a really nice shower there, I guess the bathroom light, here it is going to be your bottom left on and that's your bathroom light here so you got a real nice space here uh, and I've kind of taken the liberty of leaving some things for you here that you may need you got a clean set of towels hand towel uh, you've got additional towels up here in the back bedroom storage area you got some extra linens here you got your uh, don't know if you caught that but the um, the iron is there if you are someone who likes to iron your clothes and you've got this little fold out and you don't even need to really prop up the legs you can just keep it flat um, kind of what I do you got another TV back here uh, this TV works off the DVD so if you've got some DVDs and you want to bring those before you come down, please do. You've got some extra storage here, which I've got another. I went ahead and purchased another row of uh, shelves, and I've modified this. So you'll have plenty of storage. Uh, you've got some additional storage here. So if you've got something you want to hang up, maybe you, uh, a lot of, there's a lot of weddings here in Blue Ridge. Maybe uh, you got to hang up your, your outfit here. Um, You've got a little dirt devil here. So if you got a spill or anything you need to clean up real quick, um, feel free to do that. Uh, as far as this light goes here, I mean, all you have to do is really touch it. 
it's kind of neat and you can move this if you're wanting to read and you don't want to disturb your partner you can kind of direct that to you of course you got lights up here as well that you can direct um, the LED lights got some hooks up here uh, you've got some privacy so you got a little bit of a privacy um, a curtain here both here if somebody needs to utilize this space and this is one of the reasons why we did the twin uh, bed option because somebody can be here uh, I like to play my guitar back here uh, you can uh, of course get ready and you can you can unlatch this un velcro this and and then you'll have some privacy also uh, you can close the back area off and you can close the front area off and uh, basically have the bathroom and and the shower all to yourself so uh, as far as the shower goes, I mean, excuse me, the bathroom lights go, I usually typically just hit this bottom left hand button. So, and if you do it three times, you get three different kind of lighting options. Uh, there's a back lit mirror there. And uh, this cabinet here, if, if you do get a cut or something, I, I left some band-aids here and uh, left some off spray there just in case you need it um, but besides the door uh, uh, there's a screened in door too so um, it just unlatches here um, so some other things about the door okay when you come in and you and you use your key to unlock do not leave the key in um, in the door because if you leave it in the door and you open the door you're gonna hit the um, airstream here and you're gonna cause some significant damage to the airstream so please just uh, remember to unlock the door and then uh, put the key in your pocket uh, so that that doesn't happen uh, another thing about the door is that you can um, just use the screen in or portion of it just like that and then if you once you all do not yank on this door while it's buttoned up you want to unlatch it right there and then bring the door over so Anyway, uh, you've got an awning here. I would not recommend utilizing the awning while you're not here. If you're if you're uh, here on premise and it's if it's really windy, uh, what can happen is if if there's if there's if it's really windy, then what happens is it it'll actually mess up the airstream because this this will shake. Uh, this thing will vibrate and shake and actually do some damage to the airstream so if you're not here to monitor it please um, go ahead and um, go ahead and roll back it's automatic and let's let's go ahead I guess talk through that so all right this uh, third button down on the left is to extend it and then to retract it okay here but yeah if you're if you're not here if you're not here to monitor that another thing that can damage the airstream or the awning is rain uh, rain droplets puddle up in the middle of that awning and it causes a lot of weight on the airstream and could do some damage so if you have the awning out and then all of a sudden a uh, a, a rainstorm happens retract the awning as soon as possible uh, let's go ahead and extend that awning back out and I want to show you the other two awnings as well <clears throat>
so in the storage you've got a hook a long hook you can just use that short in there I can I can actually grab this thing with my hands but I'm just going to show it to you just extend it on down <clears throat> you just flip this rod around and you're able to extend that so the trick to this is kind of going around the world here and then getting it latched in to there uh, with this you can roll it up if you want and there's you can see the velcro and then it'll just velcro velcro back there kind of hard to do this with one hand but there you go now we're gonna grab that I'm gonna grab this hook one more time And this and with this hook I'm gonna come down I'm gonna get the, the big hook but you're gonna be able to grab a large on him and just pull it just pull it down and what's neat about this and then what's neat about this is that you can just hook that through but it's very important, very important that uh, that you monitor these awnings, you know. And if you're not here, you know, a storm can just, I mean, it's Georgia, right? We're in the southeast, so a storm can just come out of nowhere. So just monitor the awnings, uh, and you should be fine. You do have a stainless steel Weber grill here and feel free to utilize some of the dutch oven items uh, that pizza that pizza rack really works out wonderful got cornhole you got basketball you got pickleball uh in uh this back bin here driver's side uh bin is um got some of your sports items in it so feel free to utilize those the pickleballs the pickleball uh, paddles uh, basketball uh, and there's a football in there too so if you got the kids for a weekend and you want to do something fun come over here you've got uh, you've got streams it's catch and release you've got uh, two ponds uh, one particular pond in phase one is got your big bass in it and everything so uh, yeah feel free to come out here and explore if you haven't been to Blue Ridge, definitely Google Blue Ridge. It's an amazing little town. Um, but that's a checkout. That's a check-in process. You don't have to. You don't have to do dishes. You don't have to. Um, you know, with the Dutch, with the um, Dutch ovens and the and the uh, cast iron. You know, if 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 you, I would not get those wet because they rust. So, but don't feel like you have to do any dishes. Don't feel like you have to clean anything. Um, that's what the cleaning fees for we'll take care of everything uh, just please remember to drop your keys off at at the front uh, with uh, with Judy or cowboy uh, that's it guys um, enjoy the Airstream it's my baby I love this thing uh, waited eight months for it with everything that's going on with supply chain and labor issues uh, it took a long time to get this so uh, please enjoy I'll talk to you later thanks bye